Hey guys, it's BNO. We are picking Woody to do this thing. If, I think if you're on the PS3, you have the ability to play as Zerg. There is no difference though. You, you pretty, it, there is no playing difference between the characters though, I think. Though I think, actually, actually, now that I think about it, I, I'm still not sure. Uh, I, Mayor Ham, hereby make you the Sheriff of Woody's Roundup. Congratulations! You're now in charge of bringing order and prosperity to our town. So, bring in some gold and new toys and spruce up the place. Come on, get a move on. Well, if it's a sheriff you need, you sure came to the right toy. All right, all right. Let's start out by... Yep. <laughs> That's what you do. You just shake and you win. Then you press 1 to open the mi list, then you press A to see the details, the resolution is so low I can't really use this. Uh, and then you press A to use the compass, and the compass points towards your objectives, and then you just keep doing it for every single one, and so on. It's even a bright green light above it just to show you, and we did it! Uh, so yeah. And then an alien comes. Great job. You just completed a mission and earned some gold. And there's more gold where that came from if you complete missions for the folks around town. Uh, this beacon shows when a toy has a new mission for you. Okay, and we're done. That's all we have to do. That is really all we have to do. Uh... And then we just go back to the game board. And then we go to level two. Uh Perfect. Back to the story. So, was so you can see up, how much we've got. Very uh, well so I didn't well, I, I didn't get Andy everything. But, play with us one more time but like I can I can probably show you the rest of the stuff later. I, I actually haven't gotten everything in my own save as well, so yeah. Okay, so we're gonna be doing Andy's house, which doesn't which isn't entirely the same as it was last time. But I don't think we actually do really I sent Rex to the basement more. to get the cordless phone. So now we just need to find Andy's cell phone. Then, when we call it... Andy will find us with the phone and play with us one last time. I like it, cowboy! Yeehaw! Okay, so what we gotta do right now is that pressing... The minus button switches between Woody, Buzz, and Jesse, and then you. So Woody is, has the ability to swing on things. I think Buzz can throw people further, and Jesse can just jump on things. It's really all that, and we can add stuff. There's stuff like oh, the thing is that these aren't skippable if you jump if you touch them. So that's a bit of a shame. Uh. So yeah, we gotta do a, like a wall jump, so we gotta jump up, then we gotta get, I think we gotta get Buzz and Jesse actually up here. So we gotta up. Uh, let me make you watch it twice. Ugh. Yeah, but the game's actually really kind of short. Uh... Oh, come on! Okay, then we pick up the Jesse person. Uh, pun. So we jump on the thingies, even though that we really don't need to jump on all of them. Well, I haven't found any cell phone, but I have discovered a new smell. But you can also, there's also some other stuff around the house, such as that thingy, there, and, wait, what was Ham in there? Oh, that's, that's odd. Uh, they don't give you the exact climbing physics yeah, right now. Wow, he is in there. Uh, there's also some other stuff, such as physics-induced objects, which basically just includes pushing that. Getting that. Getting that. 
pretty much nothing up here. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I gotta open the box. Some stuff in the box. I'll, I'll get a lot of these items, yes. Uh. I think there's something under the bed. Like, you put it under the bed, and you don't have any items in it, really? Ugh. Can't get too hidden, I suppose. Yeah, you've got it in. I couldn't. I couldn't even see it in there. I just assumed that there was probably something in there. Uh, what else? Oh yeah, I think we're gonna throw our Woody over. His footsteps are so loud, considering that he's a toy. What are you doing? Oops. Nobody can't jump on those things, but I'll be able to not. America could probably just glitch our way over. Camera can become a problem. Or is that just Jesse just being able to jump on that? Either way, Jesse can land on that ledge, but. Glitch! That's not a glitch, that's just a random physics. Okay, good enough. So yeah, that's that's it. Not entirely. Lenny. Great, we got the cell phone. Now we just need to call it from the home phone. Rex is still MIA. And hasn't brought back the cordless phone. We better see what's keeping him. Come on. to use a mechanic in only one moment. And it's okay if there's like a the phone. But how are we going to get it down? Uh. Sir, I believe we can help. My men are deployed throughout the room but tied up at the moment. If you can free them, they'll get that phone down safely. Guaranteed. Thanks, Sarge. And, yeah, like it's okay if if they do that thing once or twice, but when they use a new mechanic like only once like every single level with this game. Like they only use the throwing uh slight spoiler. Okay, so we got Woody climbing across. I think Woody's actually the only one who can climb, I'm not sure. Actually no, I think just uh no, never mind. Ignore it, ignore it. By the way, shortcut up here. Total shortcut. So you basically pick him up. You wait for this. And then you throw him and then you motion control yourself down through all the laundry onto that ledge with the phone. Or if you're skilled enough, onto the phone itself. Doesn't really do anything though. Uh, so you could either try doing stuff over there and probably opening it up with Jesse, but, or you could do it with Woody just by doing that. Wait, if it's push pull, then why are we sliding to the left? Ah, uh, card comes first. Okay. Okay, come on, slow. Oh, actually, no, fast. Yay! See, it's us, it's us, it helps. It's like, do you want to hint or show me what to do? It's like, I know what to do! Up. Oh. Yep. Got it! Woohoo! I don't think we really actually use buzz at all during this section. 
up, so those... I was gonna say physically impossible, but no, nope, it's okay. We got Jesse, we jump on these things, probably skip one. We go up. Oh, bad camera for the win. Oh my gosh, I jumped into the top one without even. And now. Yeah, you might as well collect these coins, but the thing is that I, I believe that I played through the entire game and I got like 100 coins, and I think it cost 10 coins per, per go on it, so you really use up those coins really quickly, and those only get one coin each. Skills! Objective reached! Uh, and I think we'll last. You can actually talk to the guy and it'll like point you to the direction of. Gosh, is this, this... I never actually realized how easy this is. I was really expected it after I stated everything was actually kind of easy, but... Oh, no, wait, no. Bonus objective. Pick yourself up, soldier, and try it again. We need our bonus objectives. By the way, I apparently didn't know. Such as... Man, where are you? I didn't Stand even press off. anything. Right here, Sarge. Ah. Maybe I was because I was pressing A. By the way, yes, this is the similar basement from the... Yep, never gotten that before, so that's good. Uh, I do remember, though, that Andy has a staircase here. You can jump up two stairs at a time this time. Yay! And if you slide down the rail with the awkward camera, you get even more! Oh. Man, where are oh. you? Sound off! Right here, Sarge! Oh! Uh, hang up there. I can clearly see something up there, so it's either physics-based objects are annoying. Hmm, how do you get up there? I keep hidden objectives. Yeah, they only tell you how to actually beat the game. They don't really tell you how to get side objectives. Because most kids don't really care about side objectives, which is a bit of a shame. That's why achievements only appeal to adults of a certain audience. Okay. Or can you get this guy to get it? Can he do it? Yes, he can. Is that the best you can do? We got the thing! Woohoo! So yeah, wait right on the phone. Ugh. Touchdown! And we win. Good work. Get that phone to Andy's room. We'll find Rex and catch up with you there. Yes, sir. You heard him, Ben. Move, move, move! Quadrant. I'm almost to Zerg's fortress. Guys, come on. We need to get back. <sighs> Rex, we know you can defeat him. Just do it quickly. <laughs> now, one thing I don't understand, just saying, is that if the graphics look like they do, it, like, you could have seen the TV at just one point. I question how it's on Super Nintendo. Uh, so we got most of those. 
I can't read the little word. It's so tiny. I'll just say I got an all. Yay! Uh, so yes, we will play that Buzz Lightyear video game. Wait, wasn't he? I'll by the second movie anyway. an extremely useful cutscene. Uh, okay, so we'll start the Buzz Lightyear video game next part. See you guys.